So today is a big day. It's a big day because my best friend comes back to Texas. My name is Marcus and he goes to school in New York. He goes to Pratt. Um, right now I'm in HEB because I'm trying to find a poster board that I can ride on so that way when he gets off the plane it's like he sees it. Um, I got him tacos so I'm just gonna write I have a taco on the sign. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Um, Seven dollars? Are you kidding me? Ah, that's the, that's the price I'm looking for. Let's see. Um, I'll get white just so it can be seen better. So I got the poster board, and now all I have to do is just go to the airport. Uh, give me it, give me it. Oh, uh, there we go. I'm waiting here in the airport. Uh, he comes, his flight should be landing here in about 15 minutes. Um, there's a lot of other flights being on, um, offloaded too. Uh, but yeah, I have the sign right next to me, and then the elevator, the escalators are actually right over there, so I'm gonna go wait over there and hold up the sign. <laughs> How you doing, dude? Did I barely even notice you? <laughs> this is Marcus. Hi. Where are you from? I'm from New York City. Wait, he's not from there, but he came from New York. You have tacos for me? Yeah, I do. They're in my car. This is weird. I always imagine this to be like a massive thing. Oh yeah, no, we downscaled. Okay. We downscaled, but the pro the quality's improved. Gotcha. I've probably been here about an hour. That's, like, I was in the air for less time than you've been at the airport. <laughs> no, our problem right now is having to fit this stuff in here, and... And that's how you do it, I guess. No strategy. Just shove it in. So now the plan is to go find food and coffee. Look, he finally got his taco. <laughs> a quick detour to Richter Goods. Marcus said it was like a cool little shop. Uh, and we're trying to find an entrance in, and it's raining, and I don't like it. like one of those places that's very scared for me to be in because everything in here looks so so cool. Marcus. I ended up buying just a little patch and Marcus what did you get? I bought so much but it was like so cheap. Yeah it, it wasn't that outrageously priced. Like I think it was like 17 bucks and in Brooklyn like one pack was $17. That's ridiculous man. All right now let's do coffee and we're here at the Pearl. We are gonna go get coffee at local because Ew. that's where we want to go get coffee. I hate, I'm going to do the thing like I did in the New Mexico <laughs> block where I just hate everything. I hate local. Ew. Ew. But no, yeah, and then I'm also going to try to snap some shots of Marcus because I miss him. Hate photos. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> Woohoo! What a baller. Yeah, I'm from New York. <laughs> this is local coffee. I know, I don't know what he's talking about. Cool little hipster place. Yeah, so, um... So we hope you can see us, but Marcus, kind of explain a little bit about yourself. Okay. Where are you from? Where'd you, where'd you come from? <laughs> where'd I come from? My mother's womb. <laughs> he came from New York. <laughs> uh, what did you study while you were there? Uh, I studied architecture, and then I realized I hated architecture. Yeah. So then I switched to advertising and branding. Yeah, and he goes to Pratt Institute because he's a smart noodle. Yep. Finish drinking our coffees and we're gonna go walk into a shop. What is it called? The Sporting District. The Sporting District, which is way outrageously outpriced, but we're gonna walk in and see some cool stuff. Yeah. Wait, watch this really cool cut. Ah. So this shop is pretty cool. It has a cool little rustic feel to it. <laughs> oh, look at these! Look at these razors. Yes, Robinson Blue. That's so cute. What's the um, translation? Uh, it can go up to 4K. Uh, right now I'm shooting at 2.7K. It's recording. Yeah, it's recording. Oh. Hi. 
it's so little. Yeah, little daily block thing. That's it's cute. It's just easy to kind of like maneuver around. One of my favorite parts about having Marcus home is that he's a photographer as well. So it's very easy and very, very like welcoming because he just has me pose and then if I need him to pose, he does it and it's just, it's, yeah. it's just very great to have two photographers together. Because yeah, I'm not posing. He wants me to though. <laughs> we're gonna take a quick photo here in the middle of the street and then we're gonna go to where? Blue Goods? Blue Star. Blue Star because it's, it's a little art complex. So we're gonna go check it out. And we made it. We're here at Blue Star. Uh, this is, this, so far it looks like a, bi a bicycling company. I think they do a lot of bikes. Look at this. Yeah. Oh, okay, never mind. Blue Star is a brewing company, so they have a whole lot of different shops here. Okay, now I see what this place is. We've just been kind of walking in and out of these shops because a lot of it's not really open. It's because it's a Wednesday after since it's a Wednesday afternoon. A lot of not very good art too, so. <laughs> well, we're basically done, so we're gonna head back to the car and then go to where was that place called? Juan Stop. Juan Stop to go get some, exist, get some uh, uh, snow cones. Mango nada. Mango nada. Don't you create our culture? <laughs> it's not open. <laughs> it's not open. I don't know what we're gonna do now. We want some type of cold dessert type deal. Corn in the cup. I'm very disappointed. All right, what now? So now we're going to Joaquin's, which is kind of like a bread, it's like a pastry place. Um, I don't know, we really just want sweets. Take you home? Take you home. Marcus has to go CrossFit. He's that guy. Going back to New York. No, you're not. You're gonna be here, but we'll hang out soon, okay? All right, later. And this is where I'm gonna end it because basically I have to go to school later tonight and I'm not doing anything interesting. So yeah, I'll see you guys later.